Good morning guys and welcome back to the channel and happy Thanksgiving. We are still enjoying our Thanksgiving break here in South Carolina at Surfside Beach. It is a beautiful day today. The sun is out. It is about 60 some degrees. I am the only one awake so far. I need to get everybody up, get breakfast started, and get ready to watch the Macy's Day Parade. After the Macy's Day Parade is over, we need to start getting ready for Thanksgiving dinner. Good morning, Braylon. I have been watching the Macy's Day Parade since I was a little, little girl. And the Macy's Day Parade always starts at 9 a.m. And when I turn the TV on a couple minutes before 9 to see that the Macy's Day Parade had already started, I'm like, what is going on? Is there something like wrong with the clocks in this condo and they changed the time this year to 8.30. So I missed the first 30 minutes of the Macy's Day Parade, which is not a big deal, but I love watching like the opening and the beginning performances at the Macy's Day store before the parade starts and I missed all that. So I'm super sad. We're gonna start the parade here and Hopefully I can watch a rerun and watch the first 30 minutes of it. The beginning of the parade just made it to the Macy's building, so I get to watch it from here. I just missed all the performances and the cutting of the rope, so I feel a little bit better. Parade is over, and Braylon is in here getting ready for Thanksgiving. I'm pretty sure she is filming a get ready with me on TikTok. She is. You guys can see her little setup in here. She has it all rigged up for... TikTok, it's kind of hard whenever you're not at home, huh? Yeah. How much longer until you're ready? Um, like 10 minutes. I just need mascara, put my outfit on, brush my hair, and I'm good. Thoughts about the Macy's Day Parade? I didn't watch it. You watched some of it? Not that, I mean, like an hour of it. That was about it. Okay, did you like it? It's the same, like, as every year. Braylon is not a huge fan of any parade. It doesn't matter if it's one that we're watching on TV, if it's one that we're watching in real life. She is not a fan. I am a huge parade person and she just doesn't share the love that I do and the appreciation that I do for parades. Did you like the Macy's Day Parade? It was just okay? Brady? 7.5 out of 10. Scott? Judging? The parade! Oh my gosh. It was, a, it was a solid 7. I still give it a 10 out of 10. Macy's Day Parade, 10 out of 10, every year, no matter what. I really enjoyed the fact that they brought a lot of the older singers from back when I was a teenager, so I absolutely loved seeing that. It was like a 90s parade, I felt like, this year. It is 12 o'clock. That means it is time for us to start making Thanksgiving dinner. We have a lot of stuff we need to do to prep, get the ham in the oven, and then I think we're gonna walk down to the beach. It is still a beautiful, beautiful day. The sun is still out. I think it's like in the 60s today, and back home, it is cloudy and I think it's like 40 degrees, so I'm glad we are down south and not back home for Thanksgiving this year. Who's gonna be my helpers this year for oh. Thanksgiving? I know I can always count on my girl, Bree. Me. Me? All right, come on. All right, would you like to be in charge of the corn. green bean casserole the corn? All right, get all your corn. We are gonna start prepping all of this stuff and we'll be back. So we were on a TikTok Live while we did this, so if you guys weren't on our TikTok Live, sorry, but we just got done making our Baked corn, corn pudding, whatever you guys want to call it. We're going to get ready to, Brianna was just stirring this around, so no, I'm not going to put that in the oven with that in there. But um, we are going to get ready to put this in the oven. Braylon is over here chowing down on the snacks that we have while we're waiting for Thanksgiving dinner to be ready. Brianna was so nice to cut all that up. Some celery, some cheese and crackers over here. Everybody's getting hungry and just having the munchies. Braylon made this on her TikTok live to show everybody um, this is the best dessert ever. It is called Watergate salad. So good. Brianna's over here helping me get everything ready for the ham. Show them what we found at the grocery store. Like Elf this is my favorite. maple syrup graham crackers. All right. Oh, wait. Everyone try it at the same time. Taste test. Taste test. Did you give one to Scott? No. Smells like To your dad? All right. Ready? Go. Oh. I do not like that. 
8.7. Did not put that in the trail mix. I will literally. <laughs> I like it. it. It's like a French toast thing. French toast. Yes, it, it does is. taste like a French toast. Here, we're not the They're, They're not there. just goldfish. They have. They have. Here, you can show. A little here. present. A yeah. present, and they have a um. Where did it go? Oh, that. You don't like them? A Christmas tree. We just got done making the broccoli casserole. This is just broccoli and Velveeta cheese. We haven't put the corn in yet. You're boiling the water for the mac and cheese. We're getting ready to saute the peppers. No, we're getting ready to saute the onions and, onions and, celery. and celery for the stuffing. They are chunky. So I do not have a mixer here and they don't have one. So we are mashing the potatoes by hand and we have all been taking turns. Now it's Braylon's turn and they're still pretty chunky. Braylon would be probably the only one to complain if there was a lot of chunks in it because she doesn't like chunky potatoes. But we're gonna try to get as much of this smoothened out as we possibly so can. Hungry. Braylon's starving. Everything is in here. We have the mac and cheese. Wait, where's the corn? The corn is in there. The stuffing balls. We have the ham. Close to being. No, it's not ready yet. The ham is in there. We have the broccoli that still needs to go in. We have extra stuffing that I'm gonna make more stuffing balls. We have our rolls that we still have to put in the oven. We ended up not going down to the beach because we have been working so hard trying to make this Thanksgiving dinner. Not being home has been very challenging, trying to find different things that we can use in place of what we're used to. I really thought they were gonna have a lot more here than what they do, so it's kind of been, it's kind of been a little frustrating, but we're getting through it. So I haven't been able to leave to just let stuff cook while we go down to the beach and check it out and enjoy this nice day. We've just been kind of in here watching football and working together to get this dinner done. And it's 4.10 and we're hoping to be done and eating by five o'clock. These girls have been waiting so patiently. Food is done. Corn! The best part. No, the best part is the sauce of the ham. Look at that, look at that race. That's big. <laughs> oh my gosh. I know, it was hard. I had to come to That's because you have a, look how many mashed potatoes you have. Corn and mashed potatoes are the best part. And this took the longest time to carve this butter turkey. That was the most unfunniest thing in the whole entire world. Why is Brianna laughing? Funny. I thought it was funny. Just kidding, guys. I bought that at the grocery store. Guys, is it good? Oh yeah. What are you mean about? Just all of it? Yeah, the, but the a corn? stuffing. Oh, well, the, ew. You know what stuffing? The corn what? It is good. Is it bussin'? I'm bussin', bussin'. <laughs> Bless you! Are you guys in a food coma in here or what? I am. Food coma? As you can see behind me, it is super late. Actually, that says almost 11 o'clock, but it is actually almost 10 o'clock. It has been a super long day. We didn't really do anything other than just hang around the house and cook, but cooking all day long is exhausting. We never made it down to the beach because it does get dark now at five o'clock. So by the time we were in the kitchen doing all the cooking and then eating, it was already dark outside. We are all super tired. We're gonna get ready to go to bed. We are getting up super early. We're gonna get up at 4.30 in the morning. We are gonna do the crazy Black Friday shopping. That is a tradition. We love to do that. And the outlets open at 6 a.m. So we wanna get there by five o'clock so we can get in line. We are hoping that we get some really good deals and find a lot of good stuff there. And we are planning on vlogging our day for Black Friday shopping. So make sure you guys are looking out for that to come out soon. And we will see you guys at the next video. Hopefully you guys had a wonderful Thanksgiving.